My name is Michael Baxter. I have been writing poetry since the age of 18. In the early 80s, about 1981, I decided to write an epic poem. Came out was over 300 page poem or epic poem, which I wrote every day at small amounts. And in the end, I ended up with a rather long manuscript. And the book was about loss. It started with the idea of the loss of childhood and childhood reading. The book is divided into two halves. The first half is more the fantasy side of, and the second half is more a dystopian about what happens after a nuclear war and how a group of disparate characters travel across various oceans surviving the war and they end up in Venice. The book is fantasy and it's also an adult book, it's not for children. In some ways it's quite a dark book. It's not necessarily very positive about human nature. It's really for somebody who likes to read rather esoteric poetry in long formats, which I call an epic poem. Anyway, the uh, cover we came up with was this cover, which was my idea of the picture of Venice and the globe where the ship they sail on travels round. The eagle represents a more positive side of life, I guess. There's a huge cast of characters. There's two pages of characters. There's probably about 50 or so characters in the book who come and go. There are two couples of the main protagonists, really, of the story. They and their friends go through various adventures. It's heavily fantastic and heavily poetic. It's not a prose read, it's a, a poetic read. I do have a follow-up book, which I've just finished, which again is, has a lot of my poetry and I've it woven into that book. This is my second book called I Am A Coral Reef. I've dedicated it to my mother. I've woven lots of my poetry over the years into this book. This is the actual book, but it's not published or anything. I'm also a painter as well. My project this year has been producing art books of my prints and experimental photographs. And I'm also working on a third epic poem as well at the moment, which won't come out till next year. The Extinct Dream can be purchased on Amazon. And I've just had a film treatment finished as well. Fingers crossed, yes. <laughs>